The U.S. Air Force has unveiled the B-21 radar to the public for the first time. The aircraft can strike targets while evading detection by even the most sophisticated air defenses. Watchers say this raises new defense challenges for China. Injin reports. After years of secrecy, the U.S. Air Force unveiled its B-21 Raider nuclear stealth bomb in a ceremony at Air Force Plant 42 in Palmdale, California. The wing-shaped B-21 Raider is the first new American bomber aircraft in more than 30 years. With almost every aspect of the program classified, this sixth-generation aircraft has been designed to fly anywhere in the world, evade enemy defenses, deliver munition without the need for support aircraft, and return to base in the United States. The B-21 Raider is the first strategic bomber in more than three decades. It is a testament to America's enduring advantages in ingenuity and innovation. And it's proof of the department's long-term commitment to building advanced capabilities that will fortify America's ability to deter aggression today and into the future. Compared to the B-2 stealth bomber aircraft used by the Air Force up to now, this aircraft is much more advanced as technology has evolved greatly in terms of computing capability. The long-range bomber's first flight is expected to take place in 2023, and it will gradually replace aircrafts first flown during the Cold War. A mass production model would increase the ability for precision strike missions anywhere in the world. The deployments can, of course, also be in Northeast Asia or the Korean Peninsula. With the potential for future development of the aircraft allowing for unmanned flight, the latest reveal is expected to be in use for decades to come. At an average cost of almost $700 million each, one-third the cost of the B-2, the U.S. Air Force is planning to acquire at least 100 of the aircraft. Ian Jin, Arirang News.